Chicago Teachers Union officials held a press conference today to update the public about Karen Lewis's health condition. Officials say Lewis underwent a successful emergency surgery on Sunday after she was admitted to the hospital. We pledge her all of our support, both in aiding her recovery and in carrying on the work of the CTU, about which she cares so deeply. CTU Vice President Jesse Sharkey will assume president duties until Lewis's return. He said he spoke with Lewis a couple of days ago and that she's alert and comfortable. However, when we asked what her health may mean for the CTU and her possible bid for mayor, officials remained tight-lipped, saying they weren't privy to conversations between doctors and Lewis's family. And I must decline to answer more detailed questions about her health out of respect to the wishes of her and her family and their privacy. That Karen Lewis being in the hospital was leaked and is being made more serious just to show that she may be an ep to run for mayor. Education advocate Tanisha People says she's not surprised on how CTU is being hush-hush on Lewis's condition. She feels that people want to be sure that she's well enough to hold office. You don't want someone in office and then months later they're unable to complete the task, especially running a huge city like Chicago because they have health issues. Despite her recent health issues, Lewis's mayoral exploratory committee is moving forward. Committee spokeswoman Emma Tai released this statement that says, we have hundreds of volunteers in the city and tens of thousands of petitions collected. When she wants to make a public statement, she will. Now, we don't know how long Jesse Sharkey will serve as the interim president of the Chicago Teachers Union. Several other outlets report that Karen Lewis's hospitalization is due to a weight loss surgery she had back in March in Mexico. Now, neither the Chicago Teachers Union or Karen Lewis has confirmed or denied that report. Still at this hour, Karen Lewis is hospitalized with a serious illness. We don't know what that serious illness is. Reporting from Chicago Teachers Union headquarters in the Merchandise Mart, I'm Charles Jefferson, the Columbia Chronicle.